hey, Devante, could you just, uh, I guess, just take us through the emotion of what this weekend was like, what today was like leading up till selection day, and then just, I guess, the emotion was like uh, uh, hearing you guys' name called for the bracket? No, it's, it's crazy. Like, um, you know, just being through what I've been through, you know, while I've been in college, never having a chance to even – participate in the selection Sunday and now us getting our level seed just we just didn't know that's why I think like um our reaction what it was what it was and we're so excited just you no know, happy because we know we've been through so much you know all year you know with coach getting you know um he wasn't able to coach us for five games um just just everything you know we played games without you no know, Hunter you know Musa T Will um you know you got Zeb and things going on in that nature so just um I fight this team uh we're gonna be a very scary team in March that's all I can say. I guess what gives you confidence that you guys will be able to make some noise and go on a run here? Oh, yeah, definitely. Um, this this is the opportunity that we always, you know, we talked about, especially after the loss to Indiana. We, we were just saying we're supposed to win that game. We let that slip. So we just after that, we were just uh, basically just saying all we need is a chance. All we need is an opportunity. We're going to make the most of it. Devontae, over the weekend, did guys look at bracketology or look at, you know, how many wins this guy has versus this team? Did you guys try and figure out if you would be in or did you stay away from that stuff? I mean, you you would want to stay away, but I feel like uh, as a human being, as a, com- a competitor, um, you just can't. So, yeah, a lot of people on our team was, you know, just trying to figure out, you know, how do we match up with, like, the workers or, like, the, all the other team that was, like, kind of on the bubble. And um, we, we were just trying to figure out, like, what, where would we stand at? Uh, we would have a playing game. And after today, man, it was just that – was, that was the biggest blessing, though, we could have we could have got, honestly. And what, what was the, the consensus, I guess, after you guys looked at it? Did you guys think you were going to get in or were you really nervous? I mean, I can't speak. I can't speak for like the other people. I don't I'm know. Just, really, you, just you. That's fine. For me, I definitely was. I was nervous. I'm not going to lie. I feel like we, we let a lot of games slip. that we wasn't supposed to let slip. So I didn't I didn't know how like the people that actually, you know, make the practice. I didn't know how they would like perceive us or um, if they feel like we should be in it. So just um just seeing that we got the 11 seed against Colorado State, it will go back to Indy. I just feel like everything is um ha- everything happened for a reason. I think this is God's plan. Devontae, hey, uh, first of all, I mean, I think I probably know, but do you know anything about you know this this team you're facing, Colorado State? Uh, not not at all. But today, I definitely watched a lot of film. Just the mm-hmm. excitement in me. I just want to I want to just go watch, watch film right now. I don't want to do nothing else but go home. Um, actually, I'm going to call my parents and I'll just celebrate with them, but I yep. definitely want to just go watch film, and just um, see how we're going to beat these guys. And then I guess if, you know, you, not, not playing in the NCAA tournament before, I mean, if you could speak to, um, I mean, I imagine it's something you've watched, right? You have, you have memories of, of big moments. If you can share some of those or what it's just been like as, you know, a college basketball player who then had to watch the, the sport's biggest. No, this, um. I'm just glad I got to um, be able to go to the tournament with this group of guys. I feel like we've been through so much. Um, doubted all year. Um, obviously, we'd have had the year we, want, we wanted to have. But I feel like um, if you want to win, you got to go through some adversity. I feel like this year for us been nothing but adversity, nothing but challenges, nothing but struggles. And I feel like um, we always stay, you know, connected at the, as a unit. But um, the thing I'm going through is, like, surreal right now. Um, I was telling Frankie, you know, just a minute ago, like, I'm going to try not to cry. I feel like when I get home, I might cry just because, like, as a kid, this is something you just pray about. And, you know, the last three years at Coast Carolina, you know, I gave everything I had and I always fell short. So just being able to come here at the uh, University of Michigan, you know, with Juwan Howard and the rest of the you know, amazing coaching staff, um, just um, having the ability to play, you know, in March Madness, um, that's something everybody can't do. So me, um, personally, I'm going I'm to take this um, very seriously and take advantage of it. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, thanks, Devontae. One last question: When it comes to um, your ability and the things that you saw, obviously being in Indianapolis, there's going to be a little bit of familiarity being back in that arena. But the things that you kind of maybe watched when you got home, when it comes to film, that you maybe wanted to correct, what things have you been working on to make sure that this time around, when you go to Indy, things look a lot different? Uh, just being more of a leader. I feel like when we play Indiana, you know, and they made they run. Uh, I wasn't um, I wasn't the leader I was supposed to be like I wasn't as vocal. You no, know, I that's like me being a veteran. I got to get guys together, you know, just tell them to settle down and you know, things are going to be all right. And I feel like I didn't do a good job of that. So um, second time around, you know, going to Indy, I feel like um, I feel like God put us here for a reason. We, the first time we didn't get it done. So now we just we just coming back to get the job done.